To whom it concerns, I think I just, well, first of all, I drive for Uber Eats sometimes. I've been doing it for about a year now. I have over 1,200 deliveries. 100% rating. But anyways, I think I just caught a customer in the act of scamming Uber Eats. Uh, well, let's just put it this way. I put a, I didn't eat, have any breakfast this morning. So I thought, you know what? I feel like a keto today. So what I did was I accepted a, a $2.50 order to, and I never accept $2.50 orders because they don't tip. There's no tip there. Well, what I did was uh, I accepted it just so I can go in there and buy myself a little breakfast burrito and a soda. And the drop off was only like half a mile away to another restaurant on the same street. So I waited for the order to be ready, for mine to be ready, for the customers to be ready. They made the customers fresh, it wasn't ready. So once it was ready, both orders, mine and the customers, I went off. I got in my car and I hit ready to deliver. Well, when I hit ready to deliver, I started driving and I went into the Uber app messaging where I clicked on their button that says I'm on my way. And I noticed there was a message there 10 minutes ago from when I clicked that button, I'm on my way from the customer that said, I, I'm going to cancel this order. Well, I couldn't see that message uh, beforehand. So, what did I do then? I just messaged them, uh, sorry, they already gave me your order and uh, I'm about to arrive. It was only half a mile away from the restaurant and the name on the order was for I went in there I asked hi is there a I have her order here well there was a gentleman there uh, I let him know and he started to tell me no there's no there's nobody here that works by that name and I told him, well, maybe a customer that was there maybe five minutes ago, and then he was like, ah, maybe you're right, maybe someone that was here before. Well, anyways, I let him know, well, you can have this. They canceled it, and uh, oh, in fact, here's a message from Uber, the official message that says, this order has been canceled, and right away I thought, oh my God. He may have just scammed Uber. He may have placed the order, waited for the driver to pick up, and then told the driver, "Hey, I'm gonna, I'm gonna cancel this," and then canceled it. And the driver's only a few blocks away, so he maybe hoped for the driver to go ahead and drop off the order, and he gets himself a free meal. And I thought to myself, wow, that is a really good, that's a pretty good scam right there. Why didn't I think of that? But of course, I, w I would never do that. I, I'm recording myself saying that. And, uh, well, anyways, I wanted to share that. I'm on my way to drop off another order here. Uh, I had to share that. So if any of you guys want to, well, don't do it, right? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Don't do it. But, uh. Wow, I hope it really wasn't a scam, but man, all the clues are there. I love private investigating. I love researching. I've always loved that those fields, you know, putting puzzles to pieces of a puzzle together. And uh, it may have, I think that gentleman there, maybe he's done it many times. You know, you place the order just a few blocks away 
wait for the driver to pick up because they can see you on the app that you're already on your way and then they cancel the order and then they hope for the driver to go ahead and just drop it off anyway and they get a free meal out of it i went ahead and called it into support also just to let them know what happened and support just said you know dispose of it as you wish so i just told the guy the gentleman at that location well they told me to just do what i want so i'm gonna let you guys have it and i got paid anyway couple bucks woohoo on my way to wealth with a couple bucks have a great day